and welcome to vlogmas day nine i hope you guys are all well and enjoying these vlogs still we have made it to day nine already and i am slowly catching up to the days because i knew i'd have these days where i'm not actually doing anything but today i'm planning on going to a market which has like food stalls and there's stores where people make homemade things like candles um clothing and all of that stuff so i'm actually just going there for the food i'm hoping my friend's going to be there because she and her family uh, bought a food van and i think they're going to be there i'm not too sure if they've got a license to go there yet this little bubba is currently enjoying a peanut butter off the floor that's how we do things in this house he likes to um, wipe all the floors and then have his lunch um, I decided to give him peanut butter sandwich because it's just so easy and I know that he likes it and he's going to eat it and that we're not going to be sitting there for an hour trying to get him to eat his dinner, dinner, his lunch. We actually didn't get to go out for the last two days because it was so, so frosty outside and my car isn't the best to drive when weather conditions are bad. Like, I just don't trust my car. I feel like I'm sliding and slipping everywhere. Um... So yeah, I still need to get a new car. Um, and then I am planning on taking Ari to a Wintervale, it's called, in Waterford. Um, so hopefully we can do that this evening. Uh, we're probably gonna try and head there for about three o'clock. It's currently just 20 past 12. So once Ari's done with his lunch, I will get him dressed. Where is he? Where are you? He currently lives in these fleecy, um, baby girls they were actually gifted to us and i just make him live in them because they're just super super warm but like i stopped putting baby fleeces baby fleeces i stopped putting baby girls on him a long time ago but i found these in the pile of things that people got us and in his size range at the moment and i was like these are perfect for the winter so he lives in them at the moment but going back to what i'm doing um but once ari's finished his lunch i'm gonna get him dressed and then hopefully head out because we'll probably spend a couple of hours in the market and then we'll go up to the Wintervale in Waterford. So that's the plan. You're going to say hi, Bub Bubs? Do you want another peanut butter sandwich? Yeah? Yeah. Here you go, darling. Yeah. Constantly having to follow him around now. He just loves exploring. Where are you, Bubs? Say Tata. Tata. Ta -ta. So hopefully we should be out the house soon. Also, I wanted to say like the last couple of days it being so cold, my face has gone so dry. My lips are like starting to crack and my um my cheeks are all super dry and i'm just like wow it must be really cold <laughs> and i'm not even spending much time outside so yeah um my skin doesn't like being cold that much and um, it gets really really bad so i'm going to be applying a lot of lip balm for the next couple of days because i think it needs it but i'm also going to be taking lots of warm stuff for us so i have my um coat and scarf and then I am going to layer Ari up like loads. And I've also got gloves for me, gloves for him, a hat for both of us. This one kind of fits him, so um, that will have to do for now. And then I've got his stuff. And then I'm also taking my water bottle because that goes everywhere with me. And then I'm going to take a handbag because I'm planning on taking my camera. Hopefully I will vlog. I get a bit nervous taking my camera out in public places. But hopefully I should do and this is the outfit i'm going to be wearing you're going to have to ignore the socks because i'm putting on boots and i just had to wear these oh there we go i just had to wear these socks so this is the outfit i haven't even done my hair today i've just popped it up because i'm probably going to end up putting my hat on so i've got this um jumper on um well i'm actually really layered up i have long sleeves underneath this which I got in Primark, which I showed you that I love to just layer up on those base layers. And then I've got a, a jumper on and then I've got this um, knitted sleeveless jumper on. And then I just um, cinched it in with this belt. And again, this is a belt from um, TK Maxx and the brand is June. And I also picked up a khaki one in this. I have been on the hunt for a brown one. 
And then I'm wearing the fleece tights and I just love these in the winter. Um, they just feel so nice and cozy. Then on top of that, I've put on some 100% wool socks, which I got from Primark. And they are super, super comfortable. And they are definitely gonna keep me warm. I'll be wearing my long boots. And these are the ones I'm going to be wearing. And that's why I have decided to wear um, long socks with them. So yeah, that will keep me nice and cozy. I am now going to get Ari dressed. Okay, so we are finally ready to go. I've just applied my lippy and I have popped on my boots and baby Ari is ready also. Was you waiting for me so that I can follow you up? Yeah, yeah. He is dressed. We just got to put our coats on and um, we're ready to hit the road. You wanna go out? Okay. Yeah. Shall we go? <laughs> you little chatterbox now, aren't you? Yeah. yeah. Okay. What are you saying? You telling everybody where you're going? Are you ready to go? Are you ready to go, Bub Bubs? Yeah. <laughs> okay, we better start driving because we know you don't like sitting in there for too long. Super duper cold. Ari is actually nearly asleep. See? Ah, he's awake now. But he was asleep when I got him out of the car. But I was trying to put his hat and gloves on. And he woke up. So he hasn't had a proper nap. But, um, yeah, we'll just see how it goes. I actually didn't think I would need my hat and gloves here. But we're up in the mountains and it's pretty cold. And this place is called Mount View Market. I forgot to mention it earlier. Um, but yeah, let's go get some grub. is actually here the gun guns we have the goods where's the doggies I'm trying to look for the doggy this is what a tired face looks like nice and cozy in there We got alpacas. Oh my goodness, it is absolutely freezing. Ignore the flat head because I had my hat on and I cannot feel my toes. It is absolutely freezing outside. And I ended up meeting um, my friend's husband and their kids. So I just stood around and just chatted to them while I was waiting for my food and then I just stood up and ate there um, so I didn't get to sit down and eat and vlog but um, I tried to vlog as much as I could while I was at the Mount View uh, market 
Um, it was really like festive. I loved seeing all the the doggies with their Christmas jumper. Um, it was just so adorable, and I cannot wait to have a doggy and put Christmas um, jumpers on the dog. One of these years, I will get us a dog. I know me and Shane both want um, a puppy, so hopefully one day we will actually um, go and get one. But overall, I really had a great time. Ari is really tired and he, hopefully he's going to fall asleep. I'm going to stop off in the petrol station because I need to fill up. I also would murder a cup of coffee. I was going to get my coffee over there, but the queue was humongous. So I'm going to go fill up and grab myself a lovely cup of coffee to warm up. I honestly cannot feel my toes. And I took off my hat and scarf because it just makes um, driving a lot easier. But I can't, I had all my stuff on. I had my gloves on, my hat on, my coat, my scarf, everything. And I thought I was pretty well layered up, but it is absolutely freezing outside. Okay, so I have got my coffee and I have to talk a little bit quieter. My hair is a mess. Um, Maury is asleep. He is fast asleep back there. I don't want to disturb him because he is very, very tired. Oh, I have got my coffee and the petrol station actually does a really, really good coffee. This is the Frank and Honest one and it's actually really, really nice. The only thing is that it's not made from oat milk and this is going to make my stomach turn. Um, but I really, really was in need of coffee. I could have waited until we got to Winterville but that's still a long way away. So I just thought, let's head into the petrol station as I'm going to be filling up and grab myself a cappuccino. Um, so I've got a cappuccino. I probably won't be able to finish it because like I said, a sip normally just turns my stomach. I have had theirs before. Hopefully it should be fine. I can tolerate like small amounts of things, but milk is usually the one that gets me going but it's totally worth it because I am freezing and I, I definitely am warming up actually you probably can hear the the heaters going off in the car Um, actually maybe that's a distraction for Ari because otherwise he can hear me um, but yeah so we had a great time at Mount View Mount no Mount View Mount View Market was it called I think it's called um, had a great time there and now we are going to head into Waterford to their Winter Vale. Um, I went there two years ago I think when I was pregnant in my first vlogmas and I was pregnant there was I? No I wasn't pregnant. No I wasn't pregnant we got pregnant in January but we did go there in the first vlogmas and then we went there last year when I was pregnant because I remember needing to pee and I had to go into their Starbucks um, so I do remember going last year but I don't know if I vlogged it probably didn't but also there wasn't even a lot going on last year because of the whole Covid situation and I remember there was only a like coffee van and that's about it really um, I don't even think anything was open. Even the first year, I think I didn't get to see a full like view of it because it was still COVID. So hopefully this year it would be a lot better. Um, but yeah, I'm going to enjoy my lovely cup of um, coffee. I am actually going to stay stationary for a while to drink this and warm up and then we will hit the road. That way it can get a little bit dark because it's actually only 3.20 now and we kind of want to be there for about 4 4.30 4 ish um, just so that it's dark so it feels a bit more festive so I'm just going to enjoy this and um, maybe have a look on my phone oh that warmth just going through my chest oh that feels so good so good we 
oh I better turn that down because I'll get done for copyright um so I've just got here and it's just starting to get dark even though in the camera it looks pretty light but it is 4 20 and um somebody really kindly gave me their ticket and that was really nice of them uh, it's, it's here till um till midnight so I'll probably be passing this on to somebody else before I leave but that was really kind of them parking was sorted I have just put on my hat again and my scarf and I am embracing the cold um I don't really want to get out but I made the journey here and I want Ari to see like all the lights hopefully it's as amazing as it looks on the internet I think I saw a few pictures and it looked quite cool but the last couple of times like I said I came wasn't that great because everything was kind of closed due to covid um but yeah um i'm gonna have a little browse and see what's there it's so cold that i gave ari another blanket inside just to keep him extra extra warm he looks so snug i wish i was in there instead of him <laughs> they also have an ice rink there which wasn't there when i came the last couple of years take Ari onto one of these rides but I'm on my own here so I don't think I'll be able to so it's just going to be me and Ari having a little walk around we might have to come back with daddy and hopefully go on to one of the rides if I hadn't eaten I would have definitely got one of these hot dogs but unfortunately I've eaten already do you like all the lights do you want to go on the ride? Do you want to go on the ride, Bub Bubs? Mummy will have to come back with you so they can go on one of the rides. Yeah? Yeah? <laughs> You're not eating your snack? You're eating it now. I remember going on one of these in Brighton. It was super cool and I was actually really scared. Okay, I am back in the car. Ari needs a snack because he won't let me talk otherwise uh, there's your snack baby here we go come on yeah good boy yes yeah, so um i am back oh, what did i just do my keys i can hear you there we are uh so yeah, it wasn't like winter wonderland, unfortunately. It's a very like small version of that. And oh, it's a very small version of that. And um, I think it's great for kids that are a little bit older so that they can go on the rides and stuff. But for me, I just went for a walk and just saw what was there. And um, I think I would have gone on a ride, but I don't think any of them were suitable for Ari unless I went on there with him um, even like the horsey ones and stuff I'm not sure if you, you can go on them with them so yeah I don't know we'll have to come back and see um, if that would work I'm actually going to take off my, my um, hat and look how flat my hair is oh my god look how flat that is well that's made my hair really greasy but it did keep me very warm. Um, I don't know if I bought my... No. Um, yeah, it definitely kept me warm. But I am like an egghead now. Let's see if I can 
fix this and I'm sure there's probably cars waiting for me to park here it's actually quite busy I gave my ticket to the neighbor parked next to me um, this is gonna have to do for now yeah I'm glad I gave my ticket to somebody else to use because there's no point in throwing it away when it's valid till midnight but we are gonna head home and I am going to give Ari his dinner and then do a bath time with him and then put him to sleep. Um, so I'm gonna end the vlog here. It's probably a very short one, but I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, then make sure you give it a thumbs up and also make sure you hit that subscribe button. That would mean so much to me. And we will see you back tomorrow.